Well, after years of delays and false starts, a $61 million investment to the economy on the city's east side is well underway. What was once an abandoned, hidden, sleepy estate is now booming with new development. Eyewitness News reporter Sue Kalberg has an update on progress at the historic Redberry Estate. With almost 85 acres of raw land just east of the AT&T Center, the former Redberry Estate has plenty of room for growth. And finally, at long last, dirt is turning and prosperity is rising like the dust caused by the bustling construction. We are so excited about the redevelopment of Redberry because it's been a long time in coming. We want all of that work to live, work, and play on the east side, and they're going to offer us the opportunity to do that. It's a four-phase development. It's the jewel of the east side, and we are just shining it up and giving it a new life. The NRP group is busy building housing for the workforce that's about to arrive in the area. Almost 170,000 square foot. It's part of a multi-use development. The RK group, which is famous for convention, hospitality, and so much more, is consolidating operations here. Oh, I think it's going to be amazing. I'm and then there's the crown jewel the 1950 13,000 square foot mansion with a storied gambling house history is being reborn as a first rate special events venue. Taking down some walls, creating a more continuous space for a ballroom, renovating the, the uh, former casino. They had to demolish part of the building, but they saved all the pieces. It'll be part of the new venue. If you want to talk about booking your party for early next year, they'll talk to you about that right now. Sue Kalberg, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.